members, mayors, families, friends, and the web community for being with us on this special occasion. It is hard to believe how fast the time has gone by. For over 150 days, a team of dedicated volunteers, community leaders, and a team of canine special dogs took the streets of Nokia with one goal in mind to capture a once in a lifetime opportunity to serve you as your council. From a young age, my parents instilled in me the importance of service. My father displayed his service through our local church and by being involved in our local neighborhood association. My mother, my mother worked long nights at the county. Despite her exhaustion, she would get up every single morning with the same pink umbrella to walk to the school every day. Yes, I grew up in a very challenging community, a community based by unstableness, by crime, by drugs. However, it was a village that stood with me, and it was a village that helped my parents raise me. That village is in this building today. I thank my family, my friends, my student hall family, my wife family, my Chavez family, my badge and lovely star, Sam Zaytee family. Thank you for being here on this such important occasion. Many of my friends have turned into family. Many of you know I am an only child. No, I, not always, I, not, I didn't always get what I wanted. <laughs> but, I got a lot of love from people who were not in my bloodline. These individuals are in this room, and I want to tell them how proud I am to represent not only our community, but them. We are true examples to our future generations who are in this room, like my nieces and nephews, and my, nephews and my daughter, Ursa. We are here as an example to prove to others that we are more than just a zip code that our story is really narrated by us, and that we are more from where the college and the diploma states we are, or the title post position that we hold. I ran for office to make bold decisions, and to make policy that will make, make, help me better tomorrow for our generations. I ran for office to stand for the most vulnerable in our community, I ran for office to unite our community and move Mokitas forward. To my parents, thank you for being there for me, for teaching me how to take every challenge into an opportunity. To my daughter, thank you for being there. Thank you for being the most precious gift that I have ever received in life. I am very proud of you, and please know that I will always be there. Before anything else, I'm a mother. To my, to my community, you have my commitment that I will serve with integrity, passion, and humbleness. To my mentors in this room, Council Member Javier Campos, Assembly Member Nora Campos, Supervisor Cindy Chavez, and Ms. Rita Chavez Medina, Sister Assessor Chavez. Thank you for all the lessons. Thank you for believing in me. Thank you for guiding me. I look forward to working with all of you in order to keep our city safe, bring affordable housing, and make Lapita be place where businesses and small business owners can thrive. I want to close the same way that I began this journey, with hope and with celebration, in a grassroots collaborative movement that made history in Lapita. Our region is watching our city. And so, I want to invite you to join me in the famous Cesar Chavez Clap. We made history. We did what everybody believed we couldn't do. We did it together. Si se puede. So I'm going to say, se puede, and you guys are going to say, si se puede. Se puede? Si se puede.